work up to UK math technologies. This is a big beginner's guide to Microsoft Visual. I want to take you around this class is basically for beginners those that want to start from scratch from the scratch so first you go to your window icon or you press your window button on the screen on your keyboard and if it is not customized here you and you are using window 10 you have to scroll down to where you see visual that's under v you see your visual you click on it or possibly when you click on or you press your window icon you just type visual you see the app you click on it and it will load and take you to the app and mind you this visual works from Microsoft Office 2016 upward that's where you can get Microsoft Visual and where you come to read from the um, from this display here you see some templates here so depending on what you want to really design you just get it from here this is good for business people for electrical engineering, for um, architecture, building technology, electronics engineering, all. So, depending on what you want, you pick the template. But if you want to do something different, you click on the blank document. You can use US units or matrix units. So, I'll prefer for this tutorial using matrix units and I'll click on create to take you to your workspace and um, then in your workspace you see your ruler is here you can go to design and select the paper size you want to use I want to use A for the orientation. Is it the portrait or the landscape? For this tutorial, I want to use the landscape. Now, it gives me my workspace that I'll be making my drawings with. Then there are already customized templates um, that you can come here. There are shapes that are already available that you can use. Like, I want to go for the engineering because I am an electrical engineer by profession. I am Marvel also currently the CEO you came off technologies so I'll go to electrical now under electrical you have so many options here for example if you click on fundamental items you find out that there is all the symbols some of the symbols are here like resistors capacitors DC source, AC source, and others. You go again. Let's say um, we are going to um, pick semiconductor, semiconductors and electron tubes. So when you click on it, you see it takes here. And it will take you, that's where you see diodes, bipolar, photo uh, diode, MOSFET, diag, junction, varactor, all those so now those things those two shapes you've selected are here so anytime you want to pick any of the item you click on it it will get you here but if paraventure maybe the shapes you are looking for for example resistor that zigzag waveform type is not here and you wish to draw it you can can draw it simply go to your home here you have your tools pick your line tool anyhow you want to start it I want to start from here in order for you to have a straight line you press down shift button while drawing so I want to increase this line 
it's not big i want to increase it a bit you come to this shape style click on this arrow down get to your line and get to your width i want to use 1.5 and let's go for two so now in order for you to zoom in you press down control button and scroll your mouse or you come here down right you can see zoom in and it will zoom in then you can duplicate these two i want to drop my two first you can duplicate this line you've drawn by clicking control click and drag in order for you to make it straight from here after pressing down control button you also press shift button and leave it before you remove your hand from the control and shift button so i keep duplicating it i want to keep duplicating it then this is what i want to do click at the edge of it and take it round as you want it and keep duplicating keep increasing anyhow you want it to be keep duplicating and keep changing it i want to use this i duplicate it just keep joining it I just keep joining it I want to achieve a resistor I want to draw a resistor this is your ruler so if you want to get a ruler just click on it and drag the ruler helps you to make sure that your work is being aligned you see this went off the grid so in order for me to get that I just click on it and I move it up click on this move it up so it takes me to the line I zoom out I do the same thing this way just move it up as I want it move it up as I want it I zoom out again so my aim is I want to get to draw a resistor the graphical symbol of a resistor so I keep duplicating it the way I want it so you can see this after I finish I highlight it I come to arrange click on group I group it so I can pick it as I can pick it as one document as one object or one thing so that is just how you can draw your own resistor if you don't want the one that is here thank you and don't forget to subscribe to our channel UK math technologies